Hello world, in this video I'm going to show you something my team and I have been working on and that is a weighted round robin policy for load balancing as a service offered by, by the controller Open Daylight. So um, this time I'm going to use uh, Mininet because I had some computer problems and I really didn't feel like reinstalling the virtual machines but I normally it should work for uh, for, uh, for the open uh, open v switch as well so I, I have here the terminals three terminals running I just fired up the controller because uh, just to save time so there are no configurations uh, at this moment, however, there is some code uh, running that that I've developed, and I'm not gonna go into details how I did it. Maybe I will do another video, but I'm just gonna show you how it works. And yeah, so I'm gonna. I have here running another virtual machine. You can see the the name is different so he, I'm gonna use this virtual machine to to run Mininet so the, the, I'm gonna use a tree topology just for for random for no particular reason just to have a complex um, to have a complex infrastructure uh, infrastructure so I have here the remote controller the port uh, the switch and it's gonna we're gonna use openflow 1.1.3 so I'm gonna, just gonna fire this up okay make sure everything is running okay okay it's really good so next thing uh, actually I have a, a script that's gonna gonna configure actually a virtual IP a pool and some pool members. I'm just gonna show you the the commands and uh, yeah. Wait, let me just put this back. Okay, I'm just gonna show you this command. Okay, so the first thing we do is we create a pool and we specify the, the load balancing method method which is weighted round robin then I create a virtual IP and I associate it to, to that pool Actually, uh, so I'm gonna have 10.0.0.20 on the TCP port 5550 okay next I just create some uh, some pool members and attach them to to that pool okay so and the last thing I do is uh, I, I just print out the, the the pool members in order to to check that everything uh, has been properly created okay so I'm just gonna run the script just call the script load balancing okay so yeah, as you can see, we created the pool, the virtual IP, number one, two, three. So here we have 10.0.0.1, 10.0.0.2, and 3. Okay, so uh, in Mininet, I'm, I forgot to say, I'm connected through SSH with the, the minus, with the X option, the X option uh, activated so I have X11 uh, forwarding so in I can that allows me to do like this X term H1 and I get the new a new terminal window so here I'm just gonna write run IP ERF server on port 5550 okay that's running okay goes to same thing, PERF server port 5550. Okay, last one. Okay. So 
So now the three servers are listening on on port 5550. Okay, so next thing I'm gonna do is just I'm gonna fire up another another host. Okay, let's say host six. Okay, so I'm gonna just add the okay I have here the the MAC address for the virtual IP. The, the yeah the MAC address sorry and normally we should be ready to go first i'll just check let me check uh, to see that okay let's just check it like this uh, so we have ip erf minus c 20 and minus p okay let me just bring up the the other screen so you can see as that it's connecting to each in every host Enter. okay and I just need to bring up host one okay so now that we have all four uh, windows here we can connect and see okay so we connect to the first one just because it will by default it will, it will go on for like 10 seconds and it will generate a lot of traffic okay so you can see we're on host 2 now okay and now I'm gonna go on host 3 okay so so far so good and this is the the normal round robin that's because here you could see in the in, in the attributes we have the weight and the usage so you have one you have the weights you have equal weights for all the servers that means that it's just gonna do the, the normal round robin algorithm so what we can do is for example let's say we want server 2 would to be used more more than than the other two servers so we're just gonna change this to the northbound api we're just gonna change the okay let's put here server two okay so we're just gonna change the weight okay but before doing that okay let me just show you again what the pm uh, okay what, what's the actual state of the pool members so now each pool member has been used twice as you can see here okay so i'm just gonna copy this here okay okay so paste that in okay so now just changed it to p so as you can see you have here for the pool member number two we have the weight that's equal to 10. okay now if we go back and just minimize this and this okay now if we go back to our uh, our mini net environment and we we try to ping again normally what should we see we should see that this this one should this host should be used often well much more than than the other two so okay let's test okay so first one okay see so we're, we're still on host two host two host two two okay so we'll just go on like this okay now let me show you what what's happening so Actually, what is happening is that the usages, the the yeah the usages of p of pm2 get increased. However, the others just stay two. So we'll just have to do this a lot of times until we uh, until we get a ratio between the weight and the usage that's smaller than one over two. So I'm just gonna pause this and continue doing the same thing that I showed you until I will get to 19 and then I'll continue the video 
Okay, so yeah, I'm at 19 now, 19 uses. So, okay, I'm just gonna go back and do two more. Okay, one. Okay, so now I should be at 20. 20. Okay, let me check. Okay. So, now that we are at 20, we get the maximum, another, uh, the next best, best ratio is 1 over 2, and I think in the code there is greater or equal than, so it actually goes to 1. Now it will normally go, to, it goes to, oh no, okay, it goes to 2 now, and now it should go to 3. Okay, so again now if you continue we will keep on going in the same way because the ratio now is the, the biggest ratio is the one 10 over 23 which is bigger than 1 over 3 and yeah 1 over 3 so this is yeah this is all I wanted to show you I hope I've I've been clear if uh, if not uh, just comment down below thank you guys